now we will try to solve the language x x such that x belongs to a comma b the whole star is not regular we know the rules for how a language to be regular is so this is what is the rule for regular language so if you have a regular language you'll be having a finite automata if you select a string from that language whose length is greater than or equal to n and divide that string into u v w with the condition that length of uv should be less than or equal to n length of v is strictly greater than zero and for all i greater than or equal to zero if uv pumped i times w string belongs to l then that language is regular so this is what is the rule given for how a regular language should be we are going to use that rule to prove that this language is not regular so we will assume l is regular now we have to select a value of x so let my x be a power n b so my x x will be a power n b a power n b so this x x belongs to l so i have to select one such string from l whose length is greater than or equal to n here the length of xx is equal to 2n times 2n for both n 2n plus 2 because i have n number of a's two times and two b's i have so this is definitely greater than or equal to n so i can very well select my x x value as a power n b power n, a b a power n b now this string that belongs to l i have to divide into u v w so how are we going to divide so we have a kind of restriction that the length of u v should be less than or equal to n so let my u v be a power n and there is no restriction on the size or length of the w so let all other strings rest of the strings be in w now again i'll be splitting my a as n minus 3 v as 3 a's as i did in previous example and my w is equal to b a power n b so we can divide like this because it is satisfying the conditions that is defined in the lemma length of u v is less than or equal to n v should be strictly greater than 0 okay and let me select my i is equal to 2 you have to select the value of i in such a way that when we are going to pump v u v power i w it should not belong to the language only then we can prove that it is not a regular language so i am selecting the value of i is equal to 2 so a power n minus 3 a power 3 the whole square into b a power n b so this is going to be a power i'm sorry here n minus 3 right okay a power n plus 3 will be coming b a power n b so this is not going to belong to l because there is some three extra a's here the assumption there is a contradiction in our assumption so l is not regular we are you are using we are using proof by contradiction method now we will try to solve one more problem show that l is equal to a power p such that p is prime prime number is not regular sometimes they ask in question check whether the given language is regular or not so whatever may be the case we will be using pumping lemma because it is defining a rule for how a language to be regular so we will assume l is regular first next we select some value that belongs to l let x is equal to a power p here 
let us assume p is greater than or equal to n so that our length of p is greater than or equal to n p is some prime number the condition here is the length should be prime number so it is this language is having all a's only but the length of every string in the language is prime number so what are the possible strings in this language so it can be 1a 2a 3a 5a like that 7a's 9a's like that the length of the string should be only prime numbers that is what is given for us so we have to divide next step is you need to divide x into u v w now x contains all a's x is only all a's okay so let us not consider about remaining a's we will consider only this component because it is given that your v should be should be strictly greater than zero so what i so let we will uh, we will assume that r v is equal to a power m okay v is equal to a power m for some m in between the range of 1 to n okay and we are going to select the value of i as that prime number some prime number plus 1 prime number plus 1 because it has to be prime number only then it will be in the language now if we prove that this length of u v power i uh, w w is not a prime number is not a prime number then we can say that u v power i w does not belongs to l okay if the length of u v power i w is not a prime number then we can say that u v power i w does not belong to l that is what we are trying to prove here length of u v power i w can be given as length of u v w plus v power i minus 1 length of v power i minus 1 because i have taken one v here so v power i minus 1 we know the length of u v w it is equal to the prime number p it is equal to some prime number p and what will be this length see v length is given as m okay the length of v is given as m but i minus 1 times m length of v is given as m means length of v power i minus 1 will be equal to i minus 1 times m so for v power i minus 1 length i have given as i minus 1 times m now what is the value of this i i we are assuming as p plus 1 so substitute that value p plus 1 minus 1 into m this is going to be p plus pm so i can take it as common p power 1 plus m see here my length of u v power i w is now not equal to a prime number but a factor of p and 1 plus m surely this is not going to belong to l because p into 1 plus m has two factors has two factors one is p another one is 1 plus m to be in prime number it it should have only p as the factor okay so this u v power i w does not belongs to l so l is there is a contradiction <coughs> in our assumption there is a contradiction in our assumption so l is l is not regular so l is not regular this is how we will be proving this one so here we need to concentrate not like previous cases we need to concentrate on this p because a power p the length of every string in the language is a prime number that is what is given for us okay so we will be working out on the length of the string 
so we try to prove that length of v uh, sorry u v pump die times w is not prime means then u v power i w does not belong to l so we try to prove that one so we have taken the length and we proved that the length is not a prime number because it is having two factors p and 1 plus n so it does not belongs to l that is how we need to prove i'll give you some try problems you please try all these problems and see whether you are able to prove that the language is not regular show that l is equal to a power n b a power n for n greater than or equal to 1 is not regular so if the language is not regular we will not be able to give a finite automata and a regular expression so we will be giving context free language context free grammar and push down automata o power n 1 power 2 n such that n greater than or equal to 1 is not regular try out these problems and see whether you are able to prove it that these languages are not regular thank you